what it does, what it does. Welcome back to Rise Reacts, man. So look, I don't know if y'all know, but I love me a good interrogation. Like I listen to interrogations in the morning times, afternoon when I'm cleaning up. It's just some background noise. And I just like to listen to how people like to dig themselves in a hole. The police will tell you, you don't have to talk to us, but people will still decide to talk to the police, like make it make sense, right? So I'm on YouTube doing my thug thizzle and I seen this guy saying, well, I, the title was Smart Detective versus Smart Suspect or something like that. And it seemed interesting, so I just want to share my reaction with y'all. You dig? Now, I might not do the whole thing. The whole thing, like 35 minutes or whatnot, um, but I'm going to do as much as I can. Let's get to it. There is crime scene tape and evidence markers everywhere. A big police presence here as Miami Beach police investigate this double shooting. Two people shot and taken to the hospital. We don't know exactly how they're doing this morning, but we do know one person shot in the shoulder, another person shot in the leg. It started with words about car doors hitting each other. It ended with two men facing first degree attempted murder charges. Miami, Florida is one of the hottest locations for hip hop and rap artists to perform and record. And they can often be spotted at local restaurants. Okay. In 2021, several artists and their entourages met at Prime 112 for dinner. Before the meal had been served, shots were fired outside and confusion reigned as everyone took cover. Some of the artists who were carrying weapons became involved while others scattered to avoid being injured. One of the managers tried to leave the scene to avoid the notoriety but was caught and taken in for questioning. Uh -huh. Hey, he, hey, he tried to get the hell on. He ain't want no publicity. He ain't want no connection with this. But they was like, hey, young man, come here, come here, come here. Got your goofy ass. All right, man. So again, my name is Detective Corvo. This is Sergeant Gonzalez. Um, obviously, there was. What was your name? Gonzalez. 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 There was an incident that took place last night. In order for me to talk to you about it, I got to read you your Miranda warning. Okay. Why is it my brand under Because I don't know what you're gonna tell me. You didn't tell me that you murdered someone. You know what I mean? So I gotta read you your brand up. So can I call my lawyer and have my lawyer come down with it? Uh, at this point, that's not how it's gonna work. No. So what? basically, I got stories from different people. All right. I need to see what you're going to tell. Hold on. I feel like he lied to him. I feel like you could definitely have a lawyer down here. To... Some ain't right here, bro. Tell me. Okay. As far as your involvement, so that I can either piece it together and release you, okay. or if, like I said, you tell me you fucking, you know, bro. tying a bomb somewhere. Bro, or I, should, I mean, I didn't do nothing, bro. I like, know. this is like the, I you know a lot of people get in police custody and they play the, I didn't do anything, I didn't do anything. I ain't gonna lie. It's bare times I was in police custody and I did something. I'm not gonna lie, you know what I'm saying? Right now, I didn't do nothing, bro. Like, this, this is just, it's just so crazy to me, you know what I'm saying? I didn't do anything. So like I said, in order for me to even hear anything like that, yeah, go ahead. I gotta, I gotta leave it. All right, uh, you must understand the following rights before you're asking the question. So again, before I can ask you anything about what took place, because it was an incident where I probably All right, heard, man, we gotta do you that. You can just okay? Yeah, if I have a question about that, can I ask right now? I don't really think. Uh, well, how about the right? Yo, what's the question? I, if I don't answer it, no questions right now. If I say it right now, you be like, I don't wanna talk to you guys. I'm going to jail, right? Like just on top, just cause I just, just, it depends. Depends on what? Depends. Well, the, 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 honestly, I really did nothing, so okay. I don't mind talking to you so good. Yeah, so, uh, I agree with that. Work with that. Okay, number two. Should you talk to me, anything that you say may be introduced into evidence against you? Understand these rights? So this is not saying that that's what's gonna happen. This is saying that I have to read it to you, and you understand what I'm reading to you, pretty much is what it's saying. Look, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just skipping. I'm just trying to get to the juicy part. You know what I'm saying? As you can see, we got 35 minutes of content. So we, if we can skip, we gonna skip. Okay. Okay. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be provided for you. Knowing these rights, are you not willing to answer my questions while having a lawyer present? If that's, I mean, if I can't have my lawyer present, because that's what it sounds like you're telling me is I can't have it. This is very simple. You, know, you talk to us now, or, or you don't want to talk to us. I talk. Can I get my lawyer? They playing with this man. They playing with him right now. You can have a lawyer in any type of situation that involves the police. What are they saying? They lying to him right now. You know I'm, I'm just saying shit. Well, it's either you should all your rights or your way. So you have the right it's to attorney. We can't yeah. tell you what to do. But you can't you you talk to us. I call my attorney. He'll come right now. You 
Like he'll, uh, he will come, he'll drop whatever he's doing and come right now. <clears throat> That's not the way it's gonna happen. It's gonna work. We're gonna we're not gonna wait for that to happen. So we gotta ask you. I said, okay. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. McGrath is hesitant to talk, knowing that even though he wasn't involved, he might say something that could be misconstrued. The thought of having to spend the night in a cell is the deciding factor, and he chooses to speak to the detectives. I don't even have time to sit around. Okay. Okay. And then, is this uh, statement signed of your own free will and without any threats or promises having been made to you? They playing with him. They playing with him. Print, signature, the date, which is the. You're not suspect. Remember, suspects? No, I'm not subject. I know, I know, but just explain. I just want to go I just don't want to go to jail. You're just 6-1 of 2000. That's what you're getting That's crazy. Yeah, man. I don't even. The artist probably doesn't even realize that we didn't even make it back to the crib. All right, so now we've done this. Tell me what happened last night, man. I know that you were at Primal 12. Who did you who did you go with to Primal 12? Um, I went with... It's kind of, I have one question. It's like, whatever I say in the interview, like, is that going to, like... Who, the, the, the rapper? What? Yeah, will they go out? The no, party? man, is this for us? Bro, bro. bro, I don't trust this Gonzalez dude one bit, bro. Gonzalez is lying his ass off. And can't nobody tell me he ain't. Gonzalez is a liar, bro. Cause what? Hell no! This is uh, between us. I managed. I day to day managed Tory Lanez. He has enough going on. Mm -hmm. Tory Lanez. Um, that is a cool. Um, that's a, um, he has the his big song was the um. You gotta do more than just say You gotta do or he had the other one the um. Everyone falls in love oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. sometimes. Oh, yeah, so we were we about. were there. We were there. Um. I flew in. We had a show last night in Dallas. We flew in today. I think, uh, I don't even think that matters what time we flew in. Okay. So we flew in. Boom. Went home, went to sleep. They woke up. They called me like, yo, let's go to Prime. Da -da -da. I'm like, all right, bro, let's go to Prime. Boom. We get to Prime now. Uh, the the lady comes and gets us. Um, the general manager, they take us to the, to the upstairs to the, to the private room. Okay. We're in there. Boom. You guys inside already at this time? Yeah, we're inside already. We're inside. We're inside. Um, when we got there, it wasn't any celebrities like that yet. Everyone started coming after. It was like everyone tried to catch the 1030 reservation at the end before the kitchen closed, you know? So we're all in there. Um, ordered some water, some drinks. And um, the reason why we get that private room is because they'll let us smoke you know, mm -hmm. upstairs, you know? They charge us like $1,000 for the room or some crazy shit. And they'll let you smoke do whatever you're doing. You know, it's private. You don't have to worry about fans making it up there. Yeah, and all that. Mm -hmm. So we're up there and we're hanging out. Um, we go out on the balcony in the front. Um, have you ever been to Prime One Twelve? Yeah. I uh, you know when you're facing Prime One Twelve, you know the top layer. Yeah. The, I'm standing on that. On the balcony. On, on the balcony. Gotcha. We're standing because they, they, they wanted us to sit at the table out there. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Saying way too damn much, bro. You know what I'm saying? He, he seemed like he's smart enough not to say anything incriminating, but he's saying way too much. We was at the restaurant. We heard shots go off. We was spooked. We left. Y'all caught me. The, the whole interrogation, after they read me, my, the Miranda rights um, being read to me would have been way longer than what the hell I would have to say. Crazy. But we didn't want everyone pulling up and then seeing us um, standing at the table. So we, we did the, the upstairs back room. So we're in there. Um, we go out and we're back and forth, smoking on the balcony, going back in, talking to the girls, Bob coming back out. Then um, I have one more question, bro. I'm going to keep it. Fuck with you guys, bro. I really just don't want to go to jail, bro. All right, nothing to do with this. I, I, if I give you the best of my, can I just please go home, bro? Uh, it's like, I'm almost. Know. We're just going to talk to you. Yeah, bro. I, don't know. <laughs> I can't promise you anything. Like, like, bro, I don't I even know. know. So, you know, I see the baby, right? And the, Where at? the detective that was asking us about that shit, right? Because I know that's what this is really about. That's why it's really blowing my mind that I'm really still in jail. Because I, I know you guys know. 
that that was over there somewhere, whatever happened with them. Well, because I, the, 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 the original let's, detective let's, asked let's questions. Keep going. Let's, let's keep going. The original the the asked me about him already. Like, asked me, like, yo, did you see the other rapper? Did you see the rapper? Yo, bro, they pulled up. Bro, this guy's talking way too damn much, bro. I'm starting to get irritated. Um, I'm talking to Tori, like, yo, bro, let's go downstairs and holler at him because we just did a record with him that we're having a problem playing the record. Like, let's go talk to him uh, about the situation because it was just a little mixed blood with us getting on before them. I think they might have paid us. That's irrelevant. We might have, we just, we did something with them before. And now, like, I guess, like, they feel a little way, but we squashed it. We've been working together. So I'm like, yo, let's go say what up. And then Tori is so crazy, bro. Because Tori's like, nah, bro. I don't want to talk to that nigga, bro. I don't like the way we make people you know, straight. And we're sitting there trying to convince Tori to go downstairs and talk to him. And as we start convincing Tori to go downstairs and Tori's dubbing it, like, yes. Yeah, McCreeth shares the same reaction as Jonathan DeBaby Kirk, who was closer to the original shots. Anyway, so they already, blah, 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 whatever's going on over there. Come, come with us. We boom, come walk around. Go into the side door. As soon as we get right into this corner, it's a damn security guy with me and everything. As soon as we get like right here, right before we get to the corner, pop, 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 pop. Mother guns go, oh. Pop, pop. I'm thinking it's a firework at first, but then I'm thinking like, nah, it's just too loud. Like, it's too loud. It sounds too close. Who's shooting a, a firework? Or I had another one again. Now we dug down. Everyone's ducking down. We're crawling on the floor on the balcony. We open the door. I push my artist inside. Bro, we're calling on the floor. Um, the other kid I work with, Jabbar, that you guys just released. Wow. He was he was saying like, yo, let's just stay here in the private room and eat, bro. Who's Jabbar? Um, he was he was here with us too. Um, he was just released. Uh, like I said, I talked with him. I got with along here with the greatest. Oh, okay. like he, you guys, I think you guys took him back to the bench. He was the bro, driver. he talked okay. way too damn much, dog. Okay. Okay. So I ain't gonna lie. We all now he met us there. Me and Tori, we drove in two separate cars. Now, what, what type of car did you go? I, I, bro, I ain't, I ain't gonna hold you up, bro. I hope they still send his ass to jail. I hope he volunteered all this information and they still send his ass to jail. Because the thing is, bro, it's only gonna be three days. And I know three days is a lot. I never did three, four days, bro. I know three days is a lot, man. But it's better than... You getting played on, you know, because I'm feeling like he getting played on right now. And Gonzalez, he ready to fry his ass. If you ask me, I could be wrong. We gotta make it to the end, though. I, I have a silver S550 Mercedes. Uh, I believe it's in 2018. If it's not an 18, it's a 17. Um, if you go out there and check my my back right window, um, I was in an accident around my birthday last year, and since I got the car back, I've been having a problem with manually putting up and down the window. So my Benz is the one that the window's down. And then Tori's car is in the shop and he's driving a rental Mercedes as well. And his Mercedes, um, his Mercedes uh, is a silver as well. Mm -hmm. We left both the cars there because um, the valley was- Why are you running. talking? I almost want to say it was the Lieutenant that's here, that's doing, that was here just now. I almost want to say it was him standing in front telling us that we can't get the keys. And Tori's telling him like, yo bro, I know you probably don't know who I am, but bro, I'm a celebrity, and I really can't even be around this right now. I have my own situations going on. I, I just need to go. They was telling us we couldn't get the keys, we couldn't get the keys, we couldn't get the keys. Boom, we're like, all right. So we start walking now. Now they start putting up the, the yellow lines and shit, and we start walking. Mind you, my brother's walking, got to be $180,000 in chains on his neck. Who's that? Uh, Tori, yeah, we're walking down the street. We're walking. No security, no nothing, like just walking because they're not letting us all get the keys. So I think that's why they might've seen us moving around a lot. Again, that's because my brother's a celebrity, even though if y'all, you guys don't know who he is, I mean, we would take a picture the whole time we were in there, you know what I'm saying? So that's what that was about. We were just trying to um, to move fast and get him away from the, the restaurant. So now they put up the lines. I think, I want to say we walked down second and ocean. That's Ocean that Prime on, right? Yeah, right? So we walked down second towards, do you know where the Big Pink is? Yeah. We yeah. walked around towards the Big Pink by like a gift as well. Bro, he's talking about it's a coincidence that we're walking down the street and, and you we see him, see him by that pink. And we see him by a Big Pink uh, driving and he's like, no, nah, look, bro. Look, number sorry, slash gotta... Stranger who's adds extra time. Look, we got to skip through a little bit, bro, because he, he's trying to re 
recall the whole damn story. And it's just like, bro, what the hell happened to him? But we're going to stop and we're going to, we definitely going to listen to the narrator narrate. And Tori had a, a, a female with him. So he got in the car. The police are never happy when someone leaves the scene of the crime, even if that person isn't involved. They will have to be tracked down as potential witnesses at the very least, which takes extra time and manpower. I recently posted the deposition of Tupac Shakur, ad-free, on my Patreon. Our engineer, they all got in the car and they left. Now, we're trying to get the keys back at the cops. Just, I'm talking to the cop. It's called, she's cool, though. She's not being disrespectful. She's cool. She's like, yo, just... He went to fall, drove, he picked up, said, walk, he had in the and was like, because he just realized, you know, Tony comes all the time, and she gave him the keys. He actually got in the car and started trying to drive away, and they blocked off the whole street, and he parked the car at the Dream Hotel. Walking around, not knowing. Y'all, let me know if I'm tripping. You know, I'm skipping a lot of this, um, a lot of this video. I don't know if y'all really want to listen to this whole thing. I'm not even trying to listen to the whole thing. I just want to know if this dude go to jail or not. You know what I'm saying? Because I personally feel like they tricked his ass to get to talking and he fell for the bait. No where you think every figure out to take the Venetian, you take the mad people trying to do that again. No. They're not like so just put it in they Start telling us like, yo, put your hands out the window, turn the car off, and then tell open the front door and open this door and just got out. And they got us. All right. So just backing up a little bit, okay? Because I didn't want to interrupt when we were talking. So when the shooting first starts happening, you're still upstairs. Yeah. All right. There was a first shooting that you yeah, said. Yeah, it was like a. a, a, a I, I couldn't count how many shot. But it was when, when when they told us sixty. I was like, what? I wanted to say three, then maybe six the next time or something like that. But then again, I'm ducking. I'm looking up too, because I'm curious. Because you know, it's there's a, it's a celebrity standing down there, you know what I'm saying? So I'm looking too at the same time, like, damn. But I'm ducking, we're all ducking under the tables and shit. And then there's like, it was like a three shots or something, three or four. And then, then it was like another extended bunch of shots, like, this dude just came up with a rap beat. I'm done. Oh, what I seen in between that, I seen the black. All right, after the first set of shooting. Bro, what, what, what else did you see, bro? You didn't supposed to see anything. You talking too much. What? With mine. Two people were injured during the incident. One was released with minor injuries. But the second was permanently paralyzed. But the guy's kind of moving, so that's what we're looking at. Then I see like a black Chrysler 300. Wow. I, I, it was a black Chrysler. I think it was a 300. See that shit? Mm -hmm. And it was like, um, it was a person was in the in the black Chrysler. No, the person that was stop, trying to stop the car. I'm not sure. Is that, I think it was the black. Because for a matter of fact, they all jumped back in that black. It was now he talking about the it baby. It was so huh? quick. It was. I want to say it's somebody. It was somebody with the baby. Okay. Like you, you know, think? You think yeah, possibly? Okay. Possibly. It was somebody with the baby, bro. Okay. It was someone with the baby, bro. It was someone with the baby. Because for a matter of fact, they all jumped back in that black escalator. I don't even know how the cops let them pull off, bro. Like I'm talking about the second shooting. It's police standing as close as the door. Yeah, there's lights, lights and sirens already there, right? Yeah, there's police there already, bro. I, I, I can't even believe this that this, this is going on. You know what I'm saying? So I'm upstairs, I'm looking. I see the guy put his hands on the front of the car like that. It was just happening so fast. Like I can't. I don't know why he's trying to stop the Chrysler. I don't know. I don't. I don't know why he's trying to stop the Chrysler. You, you know? I think they shot at the Chrysler. Wow. So I think that's the well, second shooting. What happened, what happened, I think, what happened after when you see that Chrysler pulling off? All right, when I see the Chrysler pulling off, all right, first it's like a skirt, and like he's still kind of on the car. And Not a damn skirt, bro. Now, why are you so detailed with your descriptions, bro? Why? Now, I'm sorry, y'all. Now, you know, being in the black community, we all just kind of know you don't supposed to talk to the police. We all, we all just kind of know that. You know, if you don't know that, now you know that. But he did not supposed to be saying all this stuff. That's for sure. That's for sure. He just running his mouth. He just blabber lips. You feel me? The guy, he's wearing like a white tank top. He's wearing a white tank top or a white t-shirt. I think it's a white tank top. Mm -hmm. And 
he like he jumps back like off the shit like this come up yeah. and then all of a sudden you just not him, not him demonstrating now bro why is you demonstrating bro he really not trying to go to jail tonight he'll tell on his own mama if he could not go to jail tonight that's crazy sit your ass down that's what you need to do just sit down bro you up here doing a whole circus act right now man just embarrassing your folks, bro. It's, it's like it's like I was looking, right? Because they yeah, just, just shoot anything now. We gotta steal some money. Yeah, yeah. Money. it's kind of like you know what I'm saying. Like I, I'm positive that's what I see. I'm not trying to be a snitch. What it's are you positive fast, that you see? Something that I didn't see happen. I don't want to say I seen the baby securities with their guns up. Like you know what I'm saying. Like I, I'm positive that's what I see. I'm not trying to be a snitch. I'm yeah. Trying to be nothing. What? Yes, you are, bro. Yes, you are. You not trying to be a snitch. You not trying to be a snitch. You are standing up reenacting what the hell you seen. And you not trying to be no snitch. Boy, you a whole snitch, boy. You telling just tattletale. Like you ain't got you ain't holding nothing back. What kind of guy is you, bro? Man, streets ain't the same, man. I didn't flip my damn. Damn, bro. What is this guy problem, man? In our reality, bro, I can't even. You're not being a snake. I can't. I can't, bro. I can't. Oh, oh. No, you should feel good because the police officer is now saying you're not being a snitch. Believe him. Goofy ass. Nothing. In our reality, bro. I can't even. You're not being a snitch. I can't. I can't, bro. I can't. Even, you I can't even be involved in this. Like my life and my situation that I got going on right now, bro. Like I can't even be involved in this. Like, and I know that's why I got held here and all of that throughout all this shit. Because you got seen that I was already a convicted felon, and it's just like, yeah, bro. I can't even be involved in this. I didn't have no gun, bro. I didn't shoot no gun. Like that's not even life. So good at this point in right now. I'm not even like, you know, we're outside, no security. You know what I'm saying? Like life is good right now. Like what? I don't even. Did you see anybody shooting? I didn't see. I didn't see any shooting. Like it was too much, bro. Cause you gotta remember, bro. As soon as the gun starts going off, I'm ducking. You know, oh, I, so I'm I, ducking I, and I'm coming back up. Type shit. Yeah, so, so from McCreese's vantage point, the shooting wouldn't have been immediately visible. It would have been impossible to see anything while he was trying to take cover. Like. If you keep this off the record, bro, like honestly. If you can keep this off the record, oh my God. What is going on, bro? What is going on? What you want him to keep off the record? The baby got two bodyguards that are twins, bro. And I, I see the niggas with guns in their hand, bro. I all positive I see the baby walk out. The baby, but the baby was in the restaurant now. They got rushed the baby in the restaurant. Now the baby's coming out, he has a backpack. I think he had a gun when, when he was coming out. You think he had a gun when he was coming out? Bro, what is going on? What? Bro, hey, bro, he got to be banished, bro. He got to be banished, bro. He, he can't be in no clubs. He can't be nowhere. Deshaun. No, nah, I'm joking. I don't know his name. But, man, this is wild. This is wild. I ain't... I ain't never seen nothing like this a day in my life. I uh, know that's what I'm saying. All this time that y'all sat here and waited, made me wait 12 hours to talk to me. All this shit. I don't remember. That nigga probably, right, right. them niggas probably caught a jet and, and, and are out of here. Not they caught a jet. What, bro? I am flabbergasted. I am so disappointed in this man. He just in there just talking. They probably just caught a jet. I seen a baby with a gun. He got two twin security guards with guns as well. I'm not trying to be a snitch, though. If you could keep this off the record. No, nah, bro. All of this is on the record. All of this is on the record, bro. I'm so glad this video dropped so this guy can be blackballed, bro. He needs to be stopped immediately. I can't believe this boy said that. You know what I'm saying? These niggas stretch. Like, they probably... Like, you know, if they even, if they had any kind of involvement in that, they're not even here. Like, just go try to look for them. They're not here no more than you know. You know what I'm saying? Did you see anybody else from the, uh, the baby's? They all jumped in it. They all jumped in this black escalator. No, I'm asking you. 
you know them by name or by like nah. nicknames and stuff. Like, yeah, you know, you artists that you can see there. Nah, you know, they play artists I've seen with the baby. That's the only one. Yeah. Everyone sees the baby. I know I'm not the only person I told you that. Somebody at that restaurant. I ain't seen nothing, bro. Yeah, no. That kid's going. We always his manager. He's like, this is weird. Tori doesn't like his manager because it's not even the baby, it's the manager. It's the manager. It's like, no, what? what? It's like, oh, yeah, so my brother was arrested on some crazy shit. That was another reason why we just, he just needed that. He'd be around him to hit. So after that, they just started moving funny, which is weird. And Tori doesn't like his manager because it's not even the baby, it's the manager. It's the manager. It's like, it's like, say, like, you're black and white. You feel me? And there's a detective that's always giving you a problem. Then now you're the, 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 you're bigger than the detective, like you know what I'm saying. So now you're just shitting on the day, like you're just moving weird, like you know. Yeah. So as I'm sitting there, we're sitting there on the only reason we're not like downstairs, that. right? When all those shootings going on is because Tori is saying, Nah, I don't want to go talk to him. Uh, let me ask you something. Yeah, I don't Obviously, if we're here to find out what happened, we're just ruling out any type of uh, issue between you guys. Over there, you know nah, what I'm saying? Nah, bro. We yes. just, you guys were upstairs. I understand that 100%. Okay? That's really bro. My well, thing I is, why would you leave? Shut up, bro. All this shit, bro. All right, well, it died down. Like, after the last part, it died down. Gotcha. And then, bro, the, the, the people in the restaurant were running out of the restaurant. I'm talking about waitresses is running, everyone's running. Yeah. There's mayhem in the restaurant, bro. Yeah. Everyone's running. Like, I'm talking about, like, there's people that are running out of the restaurant. You know what I'm talking about? Like, I'm talking about, I know. Being fired. He taking his. Even they food just now. I'm probably going to talk lost wild money just now. Playing the scene could be taken as a sign of guilt, but it is also a natural reaction when shots are being fired. Most people in the area were trying to distance themselves as much as possible. You know what I'm saying? It's a mayhem. It's a mayhem, bro. And it's all, you know what I'm saying? We wasn't really trying to leave. We decided to the second shoot, the second shoot. Oh, where he got back to LA, back to like just all out there every time. So I just pulled tons of video, because you know downstairs, down there, oh, the, the one girl we was with had a video, but I don't even know her. She was just some random girl. She was videotaping it. Like, you can like hear it, like, but like, you know, the shootings, and she's ducking, and she's well, sure, like Chrysler, yeah. And they were taking it. I don't know how. The baby's group was apprehended a short distance away, and they were taken in for questioning. All that happened, and everyone just made it, like Chrysler, y'all didn't catch the Chrysler either? I just don't know. I'm talking as police right there. Oh, we got everybody. Oh, we got everybody. Oh. Everybody we got. So you know. Yeah. Oh, so you, you're not putting anybody out there. We got everybody, including you, that may have nothing to do with the incident. So do we, y'all got, got to talk to everybody. Got Everybody's here, bro. Y'all got the baby right here, bro. This man is wilding, dude. Everybody's here. Everybody. No, bro. Right, so let me ask you a question. Yeah, bro, What's the deal with the gun in the car? Guys over here, bro. Huh? Let me go. What's the deal with the gun in the car, man? Bro. Again, I drove there in my car, my line. We can go right now, I'll show you my car, bro. My car is the S-Class where the window is down. It's gonna be down on the right rear because there's something wrong with my shit. I don't know why. I was actually supposed to go there today. I don't know why. I can't wind the window down. If I wind it down, I can't wind it back. Bro, what makes it so crazy is when he get back with his homeboys, he gonna be like, man, I ain't say nothing. I, I kept my mouth closed. Boy, line. They gotta put like a computer up to it and put it back up. And then they, they ordered me the new part and it's just still not going down. We're trying to figure out what it was. I didn't, I wasn't in that, I'm only in that car, bro, because you, they wouldn't give me my keys to my valley. If they would've gave me my keys, bro, I didn't. I've been like that, like, I go with the other people, and it's like, bro, why did I do two S? I always leave, I, that's bad to get my keys. I can't see that. Standing up and telling is crazy, bro. That's a sweet lick. reason that anyone, and I to that, and that was like, and on your own, uh, oh, Black S Block, S550, man. Yeah, the same cars. We go back to my stuff like that. Biggie, my joke. Yeah. Really? We got it. I can verify. Got it on. Crazy. Like, is it? So. Me and you. I ate the last 24 hours. I'm telling you, dude. What's that? Yeah, bro. With McCreeth's habit of going off track, it is difficult for the detectives to keep all of the details straight. Mikhail McCreeth was not involved in the shooting and was released after questioning. Thanks again. That's crazy, dog. Bro, I ain't gonna lie to you, man. That's crazy as hell. Ain't no way.
they he don't need to be around nobody, bro. He just need to be around his kids and the the woman he loved because if he around anybody else, he gonna tell on them. He made that abundantly clear. He gonna tell on them, man. So with that being said, bro, I'm highly disappointed in this man. He obviously went home after that, and I'm sure he told all his homeboys, "Yo, I kept it solid. I ain't say nothing." Lying ass boy. With that being said, man, look, make sure y'all like, subscribe, do all that cool shit, man. Till next time, gang. Peace.